this is the algorithm to perform the searching an element in single linked list. For that purpose, we are writing a search method inside the linked list class with parameter val. Val is the data what we are searching for. Now see when the linked list is empty, that means the begin is none. If begin is none, we display that it's an empty and we will not be able to perform the search operation. So we return from the method. Otherwise, the linked list is not empty. See in this example, we are having linked list with three nodes with values A, B and C. A is connected to B and B is connected to C and the next part of C is null and the begin pointer points to the first node. Now in this case, we can perform the search operations by going to each of the node. We can find whether the value is present there or not. Now imagine we are searching for a value B. First, we need to create two variable flag and position and that need to be initialized as zero. Flag indicates whether we found the data during the traversal or not and position indicates the position of the node. A node pointer PTR is initialized with first node that is PTR equals begin. Now as long as this PTR is valid pointer, first we increase the position by one because it's pointing to a valid node. So position will be increased by one. Then we check the data belongs to the PTR whether equals to the value what we are searching for. So if PTR dot data is equal to val, if it's same, then we can say that the data is present at the location, at the position. So val is present at the position that will be displayed by using print statement. And then makes the flag as one. Whenever we find the value at a particular node, we make the flag as one to indicate that the data is present and then makes the pointer to move to the next node. So in the first case, the data is not present. So this loop will keep on repeating. The pointer goes to the next node. Now in this case, the position is increased to two because it's a second node. But here we can see that data, PTR data is B and we are searching for the value also B. If it's same, it will display the data is present and makes the flag as one. After making the flag as one, the pointer goes to the next and again the position will be increased, but the data is not same. Again, pointer will goes to the next, so it will become null. Once it reaches to null, we will stop this while loop. The while loop will be stopped once the pointer reaches to null. Outside the loop, we can check whether the value of flag is zero. If it still remains as zero, that means the value is not present. If the value was present in any of the node, the flag would have become one. So if it still remains as zero, that means it is, the value is not present. So this is the algorithm. In the first part, we check whether the link the list is empty or not, then makes the flag and position as zero, makes the pointer to start at the beginning. Use a while loop to go to each of the node and check whether the data is present in that particular node or not. If it's present, we display that it's present. And outside the loop, we check the value of flag. If it's remain, if it's zero, we say that the data is not present. In the main method, by using the object of linked list, we can perform the search operations. So in this case, we have created a linked list object and set of values has been inserted and then perform the search operation. So it will say whether the value is present in the linked list or not, if it is present at a particular location. So this is the algorithm. Try and see whether you are able to perform the search operations on single linked list. To search and find the location of a desired element in single linked list, first check linked list is empty or not by checking the value of list pointer begin. If begin pointer is null, single linked list is empty. If linked list is not empty, variable flag is assigned as zero to indicate match found or not and position as zero to indicate the node position. A node pointer PTR is assigned with the address of first node begin. So this initialization we perform, flag is initialized as zero, position is initialized as zero and a node pointer PTR is assigned with the address of first node that is begin. Repeat a loop until 
the pointer becomes null. Inside the loop, we have to first increase the value of position by 1 to indicate the new node position. The data part of the currently pointed node PTR is compared with the search value VAL. If match found, display the position and change the flag as 1 to indicate match found. So once a pointer reached to a particular node, first we increase the value of position by 1 and then we check the data part of the pointer which compare with the value what we are searching for. If it's matching, we make the flag as 1 and indicates that the match is found. Then we have to make the node pointer to go to the next node by assigning the address of next node. So the pointer moves to the next node. This loop will keep on repeating until the pointer becomes PTR becomes null. After the loop, if flag remains 0, display the search value val is not present in linked list. So after completing the loop, we can check the value of flag. If it remains as 0, that means the value is not present in the linked list.